Hi. I was talking about Lyle Knight being in, um... I'm not sure what his name I think it is in Lyle Knight. I'm not sure. But, yeah. The guy from Space Jam, the guy who is, um... The nerd with the programming in Jurassic Park. Yeah, he's gonna be in the funny... Sussus Bean Netflix show. Which is still crazy. Oh, am I gonna watch it? 100%. That probably might be the one show I return to watch in, um, streaming, because all I've been doing is watching videos and recording for the channel and making videos for you guys for a while. I have been taking breaks. I took the break since changing my scheduling, and, um, I just realized I just haven't been using all of my pills effectively, and that I realized, oh, hey... Maybe I actually do need my methylphenidate, not just for school. And I found that out the hard way when I was just a mess. And I realized having the methylphenidate, and I, I'm not using it as a drug. Okay, it's prescribed. All right. But the methylphenidate gives me the confidence. It gives me... Because here's the issue with my self-loathing issues. My self building is so bad that if I do anything fucking lazy and I don't do anything, I constantly just talk shit about myself. It, it's it's that bad. It's that bad. <laughs> Hell, like you've seen examples of it with me going back to projects because I felt like I didn't do a good job. You can already see it there, so I'm not lying about the self building part. Hell. It gets worse when I upload so many videos. However, uh, for reasons like, for example, me uploading a new LP, is because for months and months and months, you're going to be seeing some of the same stuff I recorded the last months ago, like doing stuff for this game and stuff like that. I'm like, well, I need to keep it fresh because I know how YouTube works. I need to keep it fresh. I can't, if I do this, well, well, I'll experiment. I'll see. I know Ninja Battle Heroes is my next LP. That will happen. I mean, it probably will. It will be on July 7th. I just haven't pre-recorded anything yet to this point, but I probably will after this session of me beating Zelda, doing Game Builder Garage, doing another update for F099, because the game got updated. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They added a new cup. I fucking knew there was going to be a themed cup for the Queen Cup. I fucking called it. I called it. So which means there's going to be new patterns and probably more videos of me racing around like a moron. And probably more chances for me to get more costumes. Who knows? Or maybe even get to level 100. I mean, I'm close to level 75. So it's possible. <laughs> I could reach level 100 with 300 to 400 parts. But at some rate, I probably am going to have to slow down on F-Zero vids. Because I've done so many. Because, again, I have other games I need to focus on. And other games I really, really want to return to. Such as, um, games like an Urban Champion, which got an NES port on the NES Online, so you damn well know your boy is going to, uh, do some stuff there. Uh, Donkey Kong Math Jr., which means I need to also do, probably do an NES ROM. Will I be doing NES ROMs on the modded 3DS, uh, versions? Not gameplay, just bonus stuff. Not gameplay. <laughs> Action 52 and some of the others I can't get on the online are the exceptions to the rule. But I'm ha honestly happy that I really get to uh, play a lot of these games I normally didn't get to play when I was younger. Because it shows progress and it really shows like what cool stuff I really could have played as a child. And now I get to play them in a modern setting. It's pretty cool. But I am going to try COD at some point down the road. 
I tried GTA. I tried, um... Doki Doki Literature Club. I've done a lot of stuff, so... Who's to say I won't do Demo May Cry or Yakuza or... Hell! Hell, even Bioshock! I might even play Bioshock at some point down the road. Anything can happen now. I've done so many of these games... That I've become a little bit unpredictable. Hell, I've even played out of left field games no one expected me to play. But I still love playing these games. Though I do feel frustrated. It's not because I'm frustrated at the game. It's not frustrated because of you guys. It's probably frustration from myself because I am still a victim to my own self-loathing even to this day. And it's an important lesson I've learned growing up. No matter how old you get, if you suffered the same mental illnesses as a kid, you're gonna have them for the rest of your damn life. You gotta negotiate with your demons. You gotta like um, you gotta lay out a floor plan so they can just fucking leave you alone for a few months, maybe, and maybe give you a little bit of a break. You gotta negotiate with them, not fucking antagonize them. And then maybe you might find some peace. You might find some solace. Who knows? That's just my take, but. Some people's demons can be cured, others stick with them for the remainder of their lives. It's just up to a support group of people, and if they can really forgive themselves, that those demons can subside. Who knows? But thank you guys for watching bonus stuff. I will be back with the NES version of Zelda, as well as doing Game Builder Garage and F-Zero, and probably doing Splatoon, and so many other fucking things up the damn board that I'm just running, 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 running. Thank you for watching the 3DS version, which I originally played on my old channel, which is now deleted. You can't find it. It's gone, which is why I'm doing this channel now. I think I did a better job. Uh, and you're like, well, why were you so tired and stressed out from, um, from the finale? One, I was in that tower. I was in Ganon's tower for way too fucking long. Two, it was hot as fuck. And three, the cat was self-sabotaging the entire thing for like 15 to 20 minutes. So, you could probably see why I was so exhausted in the finale. Just so much happened. <laughs> and the worst part was Burnt Joe was asleep, so he didn't even get to witness all of it. Yeah, I know. It sucks. Well, thank you all for sitting, listening to me yapping and playing Zelda. I'll see you guys with the Nintendo Switch on line version, the special edition one. I will do Inverted Edition before these four, which was the ROM and this, then I'll do those, I'll do an Inverted Edition of the special ROM, and that might be it. Again, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all later. Peace to Crispy. Bye everyone.